today I'm going to be making a review on a 64 gigabyte dictaphone digital voice recorder. First of all, it has an integrated 8 gigabyte memory limit. And it can be upgraded with up to 64 gigabytes of memory through a micro SD card. And first of all, another thing, it speaks for itself with easy to use analog features such as the lock and unlock switch, which I don't really care to use, a micro USB port jack, and a switch for MP3 music and DVR recordings, a delete button, which I don't really have <clears throat> any use for, and an A to B button, which I don't really have a use for. And it does have a headphone port and a microphone port, which you can see. Out of all the digital dictaphones I've researched, this is the best one that at least 29 bucks can buy, plus the taxes. From technically to aesthetically, this is the best one money can buy at a minimal price. Perfect for voiceovers, classroom notes, interviews, and confidential purposes, and the applications can go on with a list. It can record both MP3 format and WAV formats. The WAV formats can go up to 1,536 kps, while MP3 formats can record up to 320 or 322 kps, which is the most minimal quality format, while the WAV format is the highest quality uh, if you want to shift it to that quality format. Quality formats are optional on this device. Yes, the screen does remind me a lot of emergency weather equipment in one of those old phones from years back. Now here's an example of what a WAV file will sound like in a voice recording. Kitten? Kitten? Kitten?
that's it then. Thank you for watching this review. And stay tuned for more. There's more than where that came from.